Nothing. Nothing. Hey guys. So driving. Yeah, I'm alone. So there's nobody you to see in the cars. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm headed to an eye appointment. First eye appointment, well, at least in the last 18 months, but even before that, it's probably been more like three years. And so my eyes, a um, little bit of too much information, but my I have trifocals. Um, and I've had trifocals for like six years. And um, my eyes hate me. Um, so essentially, I... I don't like going to the optometrist and the optometrist that I was going to that got me trifocals he's just not that great um, he's actually nice but his office is horrid um, my glasses take four and five times to get made correctly um, it's really bad really bad so today I am trying out a brand new optometrist who is sounds got rave reviews really popular um, a little bit further away than from where we usually go so but it seems like totally worth it we're gonna find out the, the the reason that this is a big event is I hate optometrists and so they're gonna do all crazy stuff to my eyes they're gonna dilate them and throw shit in them and you know all that fun stuff um, and I'm not really keen on that my eyes are super sensitive even talking about my eyes my eyes are starting to water right now which really sucks um, but they're that sensitive. Just talking about an eyeball makes my eyes start watering. So, anyways, um, that's what we're headed to today. And I'm so excited, you can tell. <clears throat> we're going to see how that goes. And then I get to report back to you um, uh, right after I get out. So I may be all googly-eyed, uh, literally like Muppet, um, afterward. But so look into my eyes. Mm -hmm. And then we'll see what my eyes look like afterward, because I bet they don't look like this. I'm going to be, like, tearing all over the place. So we'll see you in a minute to see what it's like. What? Nothing. Nothing. My eyes are clean of goo and spray and droplets and whatever they put in your eyeballs at an optometrist appointment. They were good enough not to do it. And even better yet, sorry, there's a lot of traffic. Um, they were really good, really good. I was quite happy with the uh, appointment, um, as you might be able to tell. They, they, no, they didn't do the puffy air thing anymore because they don't. I guess they don't do that anymore. I guess they use like a gun, like a, like a gun. <laughs> Not like a gun. <laughs> Hold on a minute. So they used a uh, like a like a inoculation gun, you know those old ones that it so you put the little thing in. Um, they used one of those that had like a blue or a green and a red light, and they like stuck it in my eye, and um, it worked great. I did no puff of air, no terrible feeling, no droplets in my face. I mean, maybe they put drops in that gun. I remember that gun like did something. She put some liquid in it. And if it did shoot my eye, I certainly didn't feel it. Um, I had to hold my eye open, my left eye for that gun, but totally worth it, totally easy. Um, another variety of machines that I had to go through, there was a whole bunch that were pretty cool. Um, but um, the best part was there was no, no air, no drops, no, let me stick my finger in your eye none of it even though they wouldn't take my insurance and i knew this going in they don't take our eye insurance um they were so high rated that i still wanted to go even without insurance cheaper to get an appointment which was only 120 dollars, and two pairs of glasses two 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 um one sunglasses one um like normal glasses um, and I wear trifocals like I told you I wear pro what they call progressive so it's like slowly down the lens you get long long distance medium reading as you go down the lens so both progressives 
both frames. One pair of sunglasses with the super cool slick frame, the treatment that you can't see my eyeball on the other side where I look like Terminator. Um, it was pretty impressive. So two frames, one pair of sunglasses that goes on those frames with the coating. Andy Scritch coating, um, really super thin lens, all the bells and whistle coolnesses that make cool glasses today. Um, and the appointment. Cheaper than when I used my insurance the last time I went to my old doctor. So tell me how that works. So I went to my old doctor, and I'll just tell you this. I paid, <clears throat> excuse me, I paid $1,400 with getting one pair of frames and getting my appointment. And I had to get my glasses remade three times. Just, just remind you of that. This time, I get two pairs of glasses and an eye appointment for $1,300. This time, no insurance. That time, there was insurance, and I still had to pay that. So that was that was after insurance. So I don't understand. I mean, there's a lot of talk about prescriptions and medical benefits, and people, you know, is, you know, is your medical any good because they just change the prices to make more money? I don't know. What all? Go see John Oliver. I don't know. All I'm saying is, better doctor, nicer people, two pairs of glasses, cheaper. So I'm pretty stoked, and no, no, no finger in my eye, no spray, no air, no pain. Totally worth it. And if you really want to know who this doctor is, I'll put the link down in, in below, and you can go see it. Um, I don't think any of you are that local, but totally worth it. Um, can't wait to see my frame. Oh, and then my oh, by the way, my frames get here in two weeks. My old doctor, four weeks. I would really question your insurance companies at this point because I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. I get I get twice as many glasses for cheaper. Yeah. And they're really cool. You're gonna have to see them. They're really cool. I'll have to show them to you. You will see them in two weeks. Two, two, two. I should probably stop doing that because I only got two arms. Um, so anyway, weird video, I know. It's not very exciting here because this is what it's been like for the last two weeks. Yeah. Sometimes I want, wish we had a drought because it's been like this forever. Feels like forever. You know, we had that, that wonderful weather in April but it's been like this for weeks. And I would gladly give this to everyone in California, Texas, Arizona, because I just like the sun for one day. Because this is what it's been like. Really, really gross. Uh, this is like an old type vlog. This is like when I used to do the vlogs back like oh, 10 years ago, where it was just me talking to you guys all the time. And, and yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while since I've been in the truck. And there you go. It's been a while. Um, so I got to go back to work at the house and uh, we'll talk to you guys next week.